men should understand that there are more women in this world than men. That means that there are enough women for all the men in this world. Tell me about making content when it's hot. I know this is not Africa, but when Africans move to a place or any kind of people, they're coming with their culture. All right, that means that the cultures in this country are changing because of the new entrance. We lot in Africa, men have got respect for each other, meaning that. When a man notices that a woman has got a man, they are not coming. They are not going there. They are not coming to chit chat. They are not coming. They have a respect because they know that that man, there's a man there. All right. Now in this country, men don't have that respect for each other. Even when they know that this woman has got a man, they are coming to chit chat. They are coming to try and steal. They are trying to steal. Another man's woman, basically. So they have given the women power to have multiple men. In Africa, that power is not there to these women. But the Africans know that. They know the women are many. As soon as they see another man talking, or not talking, but I mean, if you're with some other man, and men know, they're not coming. So there are no fights about women, really. In general, I mean. But in the West society, Men are wondering why women have become so spoiled. Women can have three guys, four guys, five guys. Yeah? The, we are the ones doing it. If you know some woman has got a man, basically, over there, the woman has to first get rid of one man and then go to the next. In the West, the new culture, the new trend, obviously, of spoiled people, is they have multiple, multiple men. What happens in those in, in such a case? Women, they think that it's a funny thing. They enjoy it. This one pays rent, this one buys a car, this one brings the shopping, this one brings cash. Those women are having fun, they reckon. But in the end, what happens is, when, what, when those women lose their youth, okay? When they are not attractive anymore that much, all right, after 35 and you know, youth is gone, you're now older. No more attraction, people are not hollering. What do you think happens? Yeah, they have already lost their image. Away from that, if you're a woman who's been with many men, a, a new man can tell. Because you're going to be always comparing them, you're going to be, there's a character. There are things that men can use to tell that you've been with many partners. So those women who enjoy their youth with so many men, yeah, married to the street, all right, they think at a certain point, ah, I'll give it up and I'll go straight with one guy. First of all, it becomes a habit. Next, the men get to know, yeah, but also, who's the good guy who you're going to get when your youth is gone? Who also has been on, around the block, yeah? You get me? I was just thinking this this culture of multiple men, multiple men. I've got a man for this, I've got that is so common here, that's not common in Africa. In general, obviously it still happens, but in general, the Africans, the men don't go where there's another man. They notice you have a man, they will not come. So these men fights are not there. That means also the women. They don't act like that. If they've got someone, they will deal with that person. If they want to stop it, they have to leave the person before they try seeking a new partner. Over here, you see a woman, she has a man, but she's basically chasing after you. And you're thinking, what is this? You've got a man, he's actively with you. Why are you bothering me? Chill.